good morning, good afternoon everybody, and welcome to another Narnia Life episode, episode number 48. So in this episode, I'm going to be talking about the latest Narnia news and the latest Narnia rumours that I've read online regarding the Netflix Narnia adaptations. Um, so the only little bit of news has come out, um, which is that Mark Gordon is still involved in the production, in the production of the Netflix Narnia adaptation, he's still involved. And really, that's all the news. Um, the rest is all rumours, so the rest I'm going to talk about is just take with a pinch of salt. So the first rumour um, that I've read online is potentially um, one of the Narnia Netflix adaptations. We don't know which one they're going to do first, whether they're going to do Magician's Nephew or The Lion, Witch and the Wardrobe. But there has been rumours that filming may start in 2024. Uh, if this is true, likely it's more likely going to be released in 2025, potentially 2026. So who knows about that? I, I've not heard anything, but I, I have read an article saying that potentially they could start filming next year, which seems, I mean, if it is, if it is true, I mean, they've not started casting yet. So none of that information has been released. Surely the casting had been announced before they started filming. So if it is true, I'm reckoning it will be late next year. It's not going to be early next year. I mean, we're in November 2023 now, as of this recording. Can I see them filming in January? No. You know, so if they do start filming in 2024, I reckon it'd be like middle of the year, maybe back end of the year. Another rumour that I've heard, again, take these with a pinch of salt that I'm talking about right now, another rumour that I've heard is that possibly they might be thinking of combining stories. So, of course, as we all know, there are seven books in the Narnia franchise. So I've read online that, you know, these are just articles and stuff that come up on Facebook. Articles that just pop up on my phone. So who knows, if, you know, if these are going to be true or, like I said, these are just rumours, so they may or may not happen. The only confirmed piece of news is that Mark Gordon is still involved in the in the Netflix adaptations. So all these are basically just mere rumours at this point. So combined in stories, so we all assumed that because there's seven books, Netflix has the right to all seven books, there's going to be a season based on per book. So there's going to be seven seasons if they make all of them. Netflix do have the right to all seven. So similar to how they're planning to do the Harry Potter TV show, where there's going to be seven seasons, you know, one season based on a book. So I've heard that potentially they might start, they might, they're thinking of combining stories. So it means that they wouldn't be seven seasons. So it'd be like Lion, the Witch and the Wardrobe and like The Horse and His Boy might be one season, but kind of combined. Yeah, I, I don't really like the idea. I, I'd rather that they go with a full season based on each of the books. You know, that way we get a lot more of the book adapted on the screen, more true to the source material. So I don't like this whole idea of potentially of combining stories. It just sounds really silly. It, Especially with Netflix's re reputation at the moment, they are cancelling a lot of shows. There's not many shows on Netflix that have reached up to seven seasons. Um, so maybe that might be why. Maybe think they're thinking seven seasons might be a bit too long. Especially with, because obviously it's children and young actors are going to have to pretty much shoot back to back in case the actors get too old to reprise their roles. Which I understand that. So combining stories means they can kind of shoot two stories in one. So it kind of makes sense on that element, I suppose, but I, I don't really like the idea of it, in my personal opinion. Uh, let me know down in the comments what you think of it, um, but I don't, I don't really like the sound of it. Uh, I believe this next piece of news has been confirmed. It was a rumour when I read it, but I'm, I think it's been confirmed since that Amy Pascal is now involved. Um, so she's worked with uh, Greta, obviously, who's producing, directing the, the Nani adaptations. Uh, so she's worked on Little Women, she's worked on the 2016 female Ghostbusters film and she's most recently worked on the Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse. Um, 
I'm pretty sure Amy Pascal, I think that she mainly, she has worked on a lot of Marvel sort of stuff before. Uh, what, what do I think? Uh, no real thoughts as of yet. Um, I've not really seen much of Amy Pascal's work. But either way, it's news and I'm just happy. Things seem to be moving along at a very snail's pace at the moment. So yeah, so uh, I just thought I'd quickly record this video. Uh, let me know what you think of these potential rumours and little bits of news that keep coming out here and there. Not heard anything concrete, um, so that's why I've not done a Nani video for a long while. Um, but, I, you know, I was due to, I was due to do one, so... Uh, what do you guys think? If, if you, have you heard any more rumours since? Let me know in the comments. Um, of course, any major news gets dropped or any news comes up, I will record a video as soon as I can. Uh, there will be some more videos coming up. I've, I've got a bunch to do. I just... Sorry about that interruption. Uh, as I was saying, uh, you know, let me know in the comments if what your thoughts are on all of these little bits of news and rumours that have come out. Uh, let me know down in the comments and I will record another video hopefully soon. Uh, I've got a couple of ideas in mind for a couple of videos. I've still got a lot of character videos to do as well, which I started a while ago and I never finished, so I do want to finish them. Uh, but yeah, thanks for watching. Consider liking and subscribing. Um, of course, if you want to stay up to date with any of the Nani news, check out Nani Web. Um, and of course, I'll post a video as and when any major news drops. Uh, so I will see you all in the next one.